Hello and welcome everyone. I am C.S. Gilmore, and this is Dark Souls. Now, can I think of what the best paths are that we haven't explored yet. If we go down this way, I believe, there was more to that one passage than we already hit on. with these people in here first though. Thank you. Die. There we go. Where's your buddy? There you are. Okay. Up this passage. Drop in here. Kill you guys. Oops, I forgot to kill you. Well, too late. Now. Okay. Let's kill you. Okay, this sucks. So, now if I thought about it, I would have used a ranged attack before trying to climb that ladder. But I didn't think that through. We'll have to do this the hard way. There. Okay. Now what about this other passage guarded by Mr. Giant Guy? Though considering you were a skeleton, I guess you were already dead technically. Is this all this down here? Dark Moon Seance Ring. What is that? Sounds cool. Grants additional attunement slots. Ooh. That's useful. But uh, do I want to give up the rings I'm currently using? Right now I've got that one ring that helps me regain a little health every time I kill someone. And... Caster head, yeah, I've right. been in here. Is there anything else to this place? No. Alright. Yeah, so I've already... Hmm. But an extra attunement slot is really useful. I could use it. Can I get out of here? I think I can. Maybe? Hmm. I may have to go around. Yep, okay, I gotta go around. Well, bummer. I have to go the long way. I'm just gonna run it. I don't feel like fighting every single skeleton in my way. At least now, I believe I can take a shortcut. Now, I may die doing this, but I... Because th I'm not sure if I remember the shortcut very well. Ah, okay. I forgot this also I exited here. Never mind. I was thinking I'd have to do a little more than that. Okay. Got a couple choices of paths now. So we got that one passage, and we've got, yeah, we still got the one passage down there, we've got the drop-off there as well. I think I'm going to take the drop-off next, just to get that done. Ow. Okay, apparently I wasn't quite far enough for that. Hi! There's lots of you. Fix that. Uh, where did you 
come from? Seriously, why in the world did they drop down from above? I don't recall there being that many of them. Okay, let's go. Where was that drop? I know it's around here. Just need to get in the right spot. Try fall. Yeah. Okay, a little to the right. I think. So hard to see. Okay, made it. So you drop down here. And it was for soul. Okay. I better heal. And then once again, we're at this area where the ring monsters killed me. There's Black Knight up there. Probably have to deal with him another time because I imagine the ring, the wheel guys are gonna probably kill me again. Oh, there's another drop. Oh, oh I'm gonna have to do that again. Great. And drop. Let's try not to fall off this time. Maybe this way will work better. There we go. Oh, no, it maybe not. It may not work. I made a mistake. I thought that was connected. Great. Oh well. Oh, there's a lot more of you than I thought there was. These guys are such a pain. Heal. Okay. Let's try this again. There we go. Let's slip off this time. Ooh, priest stuff. And a mace. Nice. So we got the blacksmith over there. I remember hearing him before and not never figuring out how to get to him. These guys aren't all that tough hit point wise, it's just their attack is a pain. Ow. Okay, it got me pretty good there. I have to figure out how best... It seems that when they hit the wall they get stopped temporarily. I need to find a way to dodge them better and yet keep up close enough to be able to just take them out. Anyway, we got that drop. <sighs> Next, we go into the other part, portion of the which means we go down here once again. Someone killed themselves, it sounds like. And we go in here. Let's see what's in here. Okay, a nice big long passage. Looks cool. There it is. Another one of those Titanic demons. But they miss anything. Mm -hmm. Nothing to the left. I think there's a passage somewhere around here. Yep, to the right here. Passage to the right here leads further on towards Gein to the Black Knight and other things. Let me just check along the rim. Nope, nothing new. Oh wait, there's something. And there's a guy. Excuse me. Get off my land. I'll be back up in a minute. There. That's one. I think there's a second one. Yep. I 
another one down. Okay, so they're dealt with. I'm gonna use an Estus Flask so I'm ready for this demon. Next up, Titanite. Hi, buddy. You're gonna wait until I get close, aren't you? Nestle in coffin? What? What? Why would I do this? Or be able to do this? Is there a purpose to this? Strange. So, you're gonna block my path. Well, you know what? I have spells. I know you do too, I believe. Yep. Alright, you got me fair and square with that one. Also, yours appear to be better rate. Looks like its main goal is to block this passage. Oh, I keep timing those spells badly. His spells are way better ranged. Oh, okay, I forgot you could jump. Alright, let's try it this way again. Okay, he's actually tough. And. Part of it helps that he's got an advantage in the placement. He's so big. You know, I got a plan. I can't get around him very well. Their place is actually fairly good. Uh, yeah, I'll save the rusted ring for when I actually get to a swampy place. Now that done, let's between magic. Third slot. Get. Let's just put Soul Arrow in there and see how that works. There. So now I've got more range spells. I could try long-term range. the cliff we go. It's Tony. Don't wake up. Come on. Can I hit you right now? Then wake up. Ooh, that was close. What's that? Oh, did I break your concentration? Let's see how well these ones work. They're way faster. 
Oh, but they hardly do anything. Well, might as well use them. Alright. Oh, they can still break his concentration, it looks like. Casting again instead of dodging. Come here. Yeah, these ones are sting a bit. So with this one I recommend range combat. It's easier to deal with that way for sure. And he's dead. Titanite catch pole and demon titanite. What? That's a weird weapon. Titanite catch pole. Okay, strength, durability, magic. It has magic ability? Parameter bonus. Okay. Worse than others, better than others. Not as good defensively. Let's just give it a shot. I'm curious how this works. Very interesting. I don't think it's what I want though. Like for standard use. A bit slow. I'm gonna switch to this for the moment. I think we're past the regenerators. Eye of Death? Another new item. Where are you? Oh, there it is. Who are phantoms from other worlds? Huh? Urfans only Covenanter can use the item while Hollows cannot. The dreadful eyes of death spread disaster across neighboring worlds. Phantoms lured to the host world may end up as victims, allowing the eyes of death to multiply and leading to further proliferation of bane. Okay, I'm not sure how that works, but I'm guessing it means it increases the chance of you being invaded. So you could kind of choose the place, spot in place maybe, where you get invaded from. Why would I be able to rest in this coffin? Do I get healed from this one even? No, I don't get healed. It's weird. Anyway, what does that note say? Maybe it's something important. I did it. Okay. I did too. Took me a little longer than I would have liked. So we took out the Titanic Demon. Now let's go play with the things over here. You guys coming up? See you down there. Oops, I slipped. Well, at least I got the drop attack on this guy. Oh! That nearly got me. Oh yeah, I'm using the wrong weapon. Just drop down that way. Okay. I made a call too soon. Well, if I knock him down, that should give me a second to swap my weapon. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, another drop. This is an unsafe place. But I want to go through this side passage first. I'm guessing the drop will lead to the same area. More or less, just... Well, maybe not. Oh, I think the drop leads to the Dark Knight. The Black Knight down there. While this, I believe, leads to a more gentle exit. Well, I say gentle, and then there's a bunch of monsters. You guys are regenerators. That's not nice. Fine then, we'll do it your way. You die. Whoa. Okay, the Black Knight decided to come join. I didn't anticipate the Black Knight jumping in on the fun. I must have gotten his attention. Uh, this is a lot of dying. Okay, let's get ready because I'm pretty sure the Black Knight's right in here. Oh, sure. Hit me while I'm down. He's got an axe. That's a different bit of weaponry than I'm used to seeing the Dark Knight have. Stab. Mm -hmm. Whoa, lunge attack. Don't jump off the ledge. I don't have to deal with you and the spin. Ow, okay, he got me in a deadly combo there. This guy's tough. He's a tough dark knight. Try this again. Yep, there he is. All waiting for me. Um, excuse me? You just left. Get back here and fight me. I don't want to go down there with you. There's all these nasty other monsters. Perhaps you haven't noticed, but there's a bunch of pinwheel beasts. Or something. I don't know what else to call it. Can I get a lock on something at least? Ah, great. Not okay, guess I was far enough away, maybe, but actually not. Where'd you go? Dark Knight. He ran away. He ran away. He, he scampered. Well, I guess I have no choice but to go down after him. That's why I didn't want to go down there after. I was hoping he would stay up there. This Black Knight's a pain because he likes to run out after you. And to catch you off guard when you drop in. Really? Cheap. He cheap died right there. Try this approach again. Because he keeps cheap shotting me when I drop in. And that's really mean on my nerves. Mm. 
There we go. Much faster recovery now. Finally beat that guy. Sorry, that took me a lot longer than I would have liked it to. Died a lot. He kept cheap trying me when I dropped in, so I decided to lose the armor. And apparently that worked way better for me. I really do seem to work better with speed over sheer defense. Though I really do need defense too because Some, at least the defense seems to be the most helpful against the lighter enemies but all these uh, bigger ones I don't know the bigger ones I seem to do better having sheer speed now we've got to deal with these wheelie things and these exploding skulls And you guys. So there. Okay, they're dealt with. Much easier when you can get a quick run in on them. Okay, still have to figure out how to defeat these guys better. Let's do this though. Let's get across this field. Are you done yet? So wait for them to hill wall, stop spinning, and then fish them off. Otherwise they catch it from behind like that and demolish you. Uh, did you just give up? Nope. Okay. Come back. I need to kill you. So these guys aren't too bad when I don't have to worry about a dark knight jumping in and causing me a bunch of trouble in the process. Wasn't there another one of you? Where's your bed? Well, I'm gonna visit the blacksmith real quick just to get some healing. Well, not healing, uh, repairing. What's that thing? Make some smithing, then produce me some wares. Okay. Repair. Ow, my armor took a beating during all this time. If you then be gone with you. I like him even if he's grump. Alright, so let's go back here. Why are you dead? I didn't kill you. Oh, that's just a wheel. Where's the skeleton? It's supposed to be in the wheel. Well, this very is different. I think we're about to get to a boss. Traverse the white line. Try beating to a pulp. Okay. Yeah, this is a boss in here. So this is Pinwheel. He's three people morphed into one. And 
Apparently there was some necromancy involved and he's trying to undo it. Like, he's trying to find a way to become the three separate people again, I think. And I here I come in to get in his way. Okay, yeah, he's doing a lot of necromancy. Also, that's a lot of books. Hi. They seem a little surprised to have me drop in on them. And of course, instead of just saying, hey, he's gonna try to kill me. Now this guy is annoying because he clones himself. And I forgot he had that fireball. I believe the best method for dealing with this one was literally just stay on him. If you just beat him without stopping, he actually isn't all that hard. So, yeah, just keep after him and don't give him a chance to cast spells. And he's dead. Pinwheel is dead. Oh, he tried to take me with him. Right of kindling, you may now kindle beyond the normal limit. Yes! Humanity, Homeward Bone, and you usually get one of his masks too, I believe. Come on, go away. And 1500 souls. Okay, I do want to be careful not to lose these ones. Mask of the Mother. And it's random which mask you get. You never know. It varies. But it's... Uh, okay, why does this one do? A bit worse there. One of the three masks is the Pinwheel, the necromancer who stole the power of the Grave Lord and reigns over the catacombs. This mask belongs to the kindly mother, slightly raises hit points. Okay. You know, I think I'll wear that. Well, oh, actually it does quite a bit. Also, it doesn't look too bad. So that's Pinwheel. And I think this is a good spot to end this episode. I have to figure out how to get out of here. Um, exit? Somewhere? Can I climb these books? No. I know there's an exit here. Ah, here it is. Okay. So then you can climb out. And now I'm on the other side of his tomb. And this is different. Shortcut ahead. So this area is amazingly dark. And I'm not sure what to do down here. Maybe there's something in the darkness here I can find. But we'll save that for when I'm not trying to not die. So let's see if we can find a way out of here. Okay, I believe this will lead me back to the start. Grab you, soul of a proud knight. Yeah, this will lead you back outside. So, I'm going to go back to the bonfire, use these souls, and then we'll come back and explore that area. But for now, I'm just going to use a homeward bone. I'll show you how that works. So, a homeward bone, return to the last bonfire rested at. Use item. Return to the last bonfire. So, you don't lose your souls or anything, but you still get to go back to a bonfire. Kind of nice. And there we go. And I can level up again. I want. Oh, there's so many things I want. Let's get my endurance up to 20. Because I like it that way. And. Okay. I've got to choose my magic. Is that is it too helpful? Let's go with that. And repair things. Nothing too bad. 
But yeah. So I'm getting this here. Hit like, hit subscribe, leave a comment below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.